Good morning, folks. We've got solar activity and some excellent articles to close out the year. Bit of numbers fun using the American style of date writing. It is 123123, and if I remove the hash marks, that's 123123. Numbers are fun. But anyway, let's start the last 24 hours on our star. No big flares. Filaments keep snapping, but none are aimed at Earth. We are awaiting the corona hole stream to arrive either tonight or more likely tomorrow. We'll be keeping an eye on the remaining eruption threats as always, but... We'll also take a look here at the pitiful eruption of the northern filament. Did not get a solid lift, and it careened forward and largely dispersed into the corona near the limb. We've got two geophysical stories today, and we begin with the top earthquake being a 6.3 in Indonesia. Luckily, this part of the world handles bigger ones like this fairly well. Also watching the west coast of the Americas as they've got pre-earthquake signals. We mentioned the cold blast in China a few days ago, and this is a great rundown and coverage article of that event on Cold Weather Report. Link to that is below, and so are the three top stories. Starting with the macroeconomic indicators in Russia since the First World War being heavily tied to solar activity. Not the first time we've seen this, especially in the heavily studied American markets. It is about both the impact to the weather and on the human psyche. Up next, we saw the preprint for this a couple weeks ago, but now it's official and in print. Solar activity changes the storm tracks in the North Atlantic. It can be the difference between England taking a major hit or the storm heading southward towards mainland Europe. Lastly, folks, we've seen the correlations between the sun's activity and nearly everything else in the psychological and physiological realm, so let's add one more. The sun impacts children's asthma conditions. These would more closely tie in with the geomagnetic impact to Earth from the solar wind rather than the solar flaring itself. Folks, it is the last day to get our book PDFs at a discount. Whether it's solar, climate forcing, or the Earth disaster cycle, these are the key resources for the concerns that seem to be completely ignored in the mainstream news. Link is below, and we greatly appreciate your support. We'll do this all again tomorrow. Right here, but right now at 6 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.